maths. It's maths. Let's rub the magic elbow patch and see what fun is coming up today. No more sad maths. It's bad maths time. Pay attention, it's Maths Mansion, the game show where you get to test your maths ability. Feel the tension in Maths Mansion. Let's see how good at learning maths these kids are gonna be. If they want out, then they must earn it. There's no leaving till they learn it. The only way of getting out is mathematically. <laughs> Stand much more of this. Nor me. You know what your trouble is, don't you? You need to get out more. And to do that, you need to learn your maths. And you've got to learn to stay out of my program. <laughs> Hello. Now, if you're thinking about starting dating, there are some important things you need to know. For a start, how will you rate as a data? <laughs> well, thanks to my sophisticated coordinated data machine, we can tell you. It gives you a two-part score. It tells you how exy you are and how wise you are. <laughs> now, Snorter here has volunteered to test it. So let's connect him up and then switch on the sophisticated coordinated data machine like this. And out comes his two-part score. And here it is. Snorter has scored 2-3. But where does that put him on the dating grid? <laughs> well, as you can see, our dating grid is rather like a huge chart or graph. And we're going to find Snorter's position on it. <laughs> the more exy he is, the further he'll move in the x direction. And the more wise he is, the further he'll go that way. <laughs> right, so he starts off at zero. A quick reminder of the coordinates, two, three. The first number tells us he moves two units in the x direction. There we go. And the second coordinate tells us he moves three units up in the y direction. Up he goes. Hee <laughs> hee, we put you there. Well done, Snorter. So, Snorter's coordinates are two, three. A little bit exy and a little bit wise. Hee <laughs> hee. Oh, come and do the dating test. Come on, get analysed. Find out all about your ex. Find out about your why. If you want to get a date before you find a mate. And why scores right? Check out your coordinates. I'll oh, come and do the dating test. Come on, get analyzed. Find out all about your ex. Find out about your why. Before you start to practice, get positioned on each axis. Find out about your ex and why. Find out if you score low or high. We don't need a machine to measure your mathematical skills, if any. We can find out with the warm-up test. Your names, if you please. I'm Sarah McNicholas from Swansea. And I'm Christian Cooper from Southend. Now, can you handle coordinates? Put them on the grid. I'll do X scores, moving one in the X direction, then three in the Y direction. One, three. One more. Five in the X direction, one in the Y direction. Five, one. Very good. Oh, very bad. Let's see how Mr Giraffe does. He's already connected, so let's switch on the sophisticated coordinated data machine. Chugga, chugga, chugga. Oh, and out comes his two-part score. Oh, Mr Jahalf. It says two... Negative three. Oh dear. So where does he fit on the graph? Well, let's have a look. If we start off here, moving along two on the x-axis, one, two, but negative three on the y-axis. So we go down one, two, three. That's where you belong, Mr. Jahaf. <laughs> now what about Miss Sniff? How will she rate as a data? Well, let's get her connected. One on that leg, one on that 
Lick and switch on our sophisticated coordinated data machine like that. And out comes her two-part score. Hee-hee! <laughs> and there it is. Negative four, positive two. Oh, dear, Miss Sniff. Not very exy, but quite wise. Yes. So, Miss Sniff, she starts there, heads off left on the x-axis to negative four. And she goes up two on the y-axis. There she is. Hee-hee. <laughs> oh, I wonder how thick stick is going to do. Oh, come and do the dating test. Come on, get analysed. Find out all about your X. Find out about your Y. If X is positive in your test, then you go right, which is the best. But if you score a negative X, you'll find out that you move left. If Y is positive in your test, you go up, which is the best. But if you score a negative Y, down you go and not up high. If X is negative and Y too, it's left you go, then down for you. It won't come as a big surprise. Thick stick's not Xy and not Y's. Oh, excuse me, would you mind stepping this way? You see, I'm doing a survey and I just wondered, how exy would you say your sister is, madam? Between negative five and positive five, where would you put her? There. Zero? Oh dear, oh dear. Oh, well, that's not very good. But how wise would you say she was? There. Negative two? Oh dear, it just gets worse. Let's put her down. There you are. I'm afraid that's not very good, madam. You have scored zero on the oh. X scale, <laughs> but negative two on the Y. You better take her home. Are you ready for the test? Because the test is ready for you. Right, there are four different quadrants. Give me a point that's in the first quadrant. X is two, Y is three. Two, three. OK, second quadrant. Um, negative X, positive Y. I know. X is negative three, Y is three. Negative three, three. Third quadrant. Um, uh, how? Both negative, like thick stick. All right. X is negative four, Y is negative two. Negative four, negative two. Last one. Fourth quadrant. Um, X is five, Y is negative five. Have you finished? Uh, five, negative five. Yes, just in time. You got a point in each of the four quadrants. So, you get yourselves a maths card. Yes! And let's see what it is. Oh, thick stick. Nothing personal, I can assure you. Take it and be gone. Now, how are you at plotting coordinates? Have a go at this. Plot the points with coordinates. Two, two. Negative two, negative two. Four, negative four. Negative four, four. Join the points to make a quadrilateral. Is it a rectangle, a rhombus, or a kite? And remember, no leaving without learning. Pay attention, it's Maths Mansion. The game show where you get to test your maths ability. Feel the tension in Maths Mansion. Let's see how good at learning maths these kids are gonna be. If they want out, then they must earn it. There's no leaving till they learn it. The only way of getting out is mathematically. <laughs> well, at least I can't do any worse than that thick stick. <laughs> Here he goes. Chugga, chugga, chugga. Ooh. Oh, dear. <laughs>